Hello everyone in Eden and welcome back to Breath of the Wild. Today we are continuing on with finishing up the shrines so that we can do all 120. I'm heading towards the red marker right now. I mentioned at the end of the last episode that I kind of remembered that there was a, uh, a shrine out here in the desert and I couldn't remember exactly where it was but then I remembered it was kind of over by where I fought, uh, or not fought, but uh, tamed Vonoboris. So I'm on a sand seal and we are heading over there. Um, for anyone new to my channel, <laughs> please stop leaving comments that I need to improve my gameplay. I've already beat the game, you guys. <laughs> my longtime viewers have uh, or, uh, unlocked the community reward to finish the 120 shrines, so that's what these episodes are for. <laughs> I'm still getting comments. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I'm still getting comments telling me that I need to get better at flurry rushing and parrying. And yes, I am aware. Wait, no, it was somewhere over here. Where? I'm not going the right direction. Oh, there it is. Yes, I'm aware I'm not good at those things, but I've already beat the game. I'm living proof that you can beat this game and not be fantastic at combat. <laughs> but thank you for watching and for making suggestions. <laughs> but no, I don't need to improve my gameplay. I've already beat the game. Missei Suma Shrine. Ma'am, can you not die on my shrine pedestal? I'm done for. What happened? I just found the shrine too. Ugh, my throat. It's so dry. I can't move a muscle. If this really is the end... I wish I could have one last taste, one sip, one sip of an ice cold noble pursuit. So she needs a cocktail to get out of my way? The perfect drink. Uh, oh, I'm too hot. I didn't even realize that. Oh my goodness. Okay. Um, wait, J just, just a second. Perfect drink. Uh, Gruda named Pokey has collapsed in front of Asian Shrine. You'll have to find a way to revive her if you want to get inside. Um, okay. Wait, so where does that... So it wants me to go back to Gerudo Town? Okay. Let's do that before I before I perish as well of the heat. So oh you know what? I remember there was like a, a bar, right? So I probably have to get the the drink from the bar so that she can replenish her hydration and get off my shrine so that I may obtain my spirit orb. All right, let's go. But yes, I am aware I'm not great at combat. <laughs> but it's so funny. I'm, I'm like, I'm on episode 80 something and have even said I've beat the game. And yet people are still like, oh, you know, you'll get better as you play more. No, I'm already almost done. Uh, I love this game. And I actually really miss this game after I beat it. Where am I going? I'm just blabbering here. I actually really miss this game after I beat it and took a break. But um, I would say like 99% of the... The community it's brought me is amazing but then there's always you know an occasional toxic gatekeeper that is like you're not very good at this maybe you shouldn't have a gaming channel ah. the suck a hylian vi huh i can't tell how old you are but this place is definitely not for young vi because the drinks we make here are different from regular ones for one they have a rare treat in them ice can i get a noble pursuit you want to try our signature drink noble pursuit unfortunately i need a huge amount of ice to make that drink i'm fresh out right now Besides, it's a really strong drink. I think I can handle it. Well, I guess Pokey can handle it. Even if I could make it, I wouldn't sell it to a little Vi like you, actually. So you see, there's a woman dying of thirst. What'd you say? Pokey's collapsed? Hmm, I want to help her out, but I can't make it you-know-what without ice. There's ice at the ice house, but my legs aren't in the best shape for hauling ice. I guess I'll get it. I gotta do everything for these people, man. Are you serious? You'll get it. That oh, you, You'll get it? That'd be a huge help. Pokey is my best customer, after all. I wish I could get the ice myself. Anyway, the ice house is north of town. Anchi, Anch, Anchi manage, manages it, but I think if you explain the situation, she'll let you have some ice. Hi, Luna. Uh, my dog just busted open the door. Hold on. Okay, door is closed. You should know that she heads to bed quite early. If you plan to go, you'll need to get there while it's bright out. Oh, so I have to go during the day? What time is it right now? Oh, young lady, carrying ice all the way through the desert and then all the way to town? I can't let that stand. If you bring the ice to the entrance... If you bring the ice to the entrance to the ruins between town and the ice house, I can take it from there. Oh, okay. Well, so, gotta get it halfway. Okay. Ice house. I have not... I thought I explored the desert pretty well. I keep saying this. I feel like I explored pretty well, but I never even came across an ice house. So, where is it? All the way up here? Okay. Should I even... Should I get a sand seal again? I feel like that's making things go a little faster. I don't care that it's costing me money. But anyways, I said this in another video, but... um. The new filming room I'm in, the door like doesn't shut properly, so it's easy for the dogs to just like kick open the door, like the Kool-Aid man, like, 
Oh yeah. The suck. If you're hoping, yeah, yeah, stand seal, please. That's literally what it's like, the Kool-Aid man busting in. Seal the deal. But anyways, yeah, as I was saying, uh, just because uh, I'm not good at gaming doesn't mean I can't have a gaming channel, okay? This is my hobby. This is my hobby and I do it for fun. You can play games for fun without having to be the best at them. Again, as I met- oh! You know what, I think I found these? These ruins, okay. So these are the ruins she's talking about. There's enemies in there. What time is it? Okay. So I'm f- go, go. Uh, I'm fine. Yeah, no, I came this way. Haven't I? I don't know, man. Oh, lord. Yep, there's- Oh god. Nope, get me out of here. You know, I, I think I came to these ruins, but I don't think I- I definitely must not have come all the way this way. Okay, here we go. What's- what's in here? What's over this? What's over this? I don't even know what I'm saying. What is this? Uh, like a trebuchet thing? What? Can I, like, cut this? No. Interesting. I don't know what... I don't know what purpose this would serve. Can I... I'm just curious here. Uh, no? Stasis? Huh. Well, that's interesting. Okay, well, I'll, I'll climb the ladder that I saw over there. Oh! Oh, you go down! I totally missed that. But then there's another ladder over here, too. Where, where was that? Blah. Spinning the camera around. So I only have to get the ice through here? I, I feel like that's not going to be that hard, but like... I also... Could be overestimating. Or underestimating it. Yeah, what is... Uh, go, 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 go. I'm, you know, I'm probably going to mess up here because they said she goes to bed early and no 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 and i'm probably it's almost night so i feel like i'm kind of gonna mess myself up here if i wait too long okay what i feel like i claimed this for nothing is there a korok up here at least not that it matters anymore I, like i said beat the game no okay well let me let me head down before i miss my opportunity But yes, this is this is a hobby for me. This is fun, so I don't care if I'm good or not. I just want to have a good time. And I think that's why most of my audience is here, because you are having a good time with me, and I appreciate it. Oh. Anchi, this is an ice house used for storing the ice brought from the mountains. Seeing as we live in a desert, it's pretty important for us Gerudo, so I guard the ice house 24 hours a day. Actually, can I have one of these? Oh. Well, if Ferosa wants ice, then you should bring her some. You're permitted to take some ice. You've taken the heat into account. Oh. If you move too slowly, the ice will surely melt. Furosa has no use for water. Okay. Um. I feel like I need to plan stuff. Oh, goodness. Okay, hold on. Um. Inventory. Do I have a speed elixir? <gasps> I do. Okay. Drink. And then, what time is it? Uh. Do I have anything... I don't have like any ice weapons. Uh, okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna say maybe. I no, 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 no. Oh, can I leave it in here? Oh, you know what I should do too. Hold on. I don't like timed stuff. I always panic. I need the. Where's the sand boots? I have those. I don't know if that'll help. Here we go. How's the the weather? I'm fine. It's gonna get cold. Oh, but you know what? That's good. It's gonna get cold, right? Uh, okay. Should I just walk it straight through here? I don't know if the boots are helping. Okay, I, I feel like maybe with the elixir and the boots it's helping. Should I just walk it straight through here? But I know, I, like I said, I know there's enemies. Oh, but I guess the boots aren't helping because now I'm not on the sand. Well, I have the elixir. That's fine. I just need to get it through here, right? Oh no, I see enemies. Maybe I should skirt around here. Maybe I'll do that. Oh god, there, there's one. There's one. Don't mind me. No, 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 no. Excuse me. Nope. Excuse me. Oh, Jesus. Oh no, he shot a fire arrow at me. Now it's like really... Oh no. 
sorry there's there might be some weird cuts my uh husband just got home from the gym and so i think my dogs are going to be going crazy in the background so i might have to cut it if they're being too loud okay Ooh. oh man that fire arrow really melted it but i feel like okay go 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 i'm almost there okay stay in the shade maybe that'll help yeah sorry there might be a lot of background noise Okay, how, how big does it have to be? I feel like it's pretty good, right? Okay, I'm here. I'm here. Where is she? Oh, thank God. Hey, over here, this way. Bring the ice over here. Okay, okay, go, 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 go. Oh my God. Go, 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 go. Is it big enough? Please be big enough. Whoa, no doubt that no doubt about it. That's definitely ice from the ice house. I'll be able to make a noble pursuit with this. It may be the best I've ever made. I've got one more favor to ask. Oh, okay. Could you go and let Pokey know? Just tell her the best drink ever is waiting for her. Uh. What? No, of course this will work. Knowing her, if she hears a delicious drink is waiting, she'll come running. She will come running for a cocktail. I think that's a problem. <laughs> is this alcoholic? I feel like she... Well, no, yeah. She said it was a strong drink, so it must be alcoholic. Uh, so I have to go back now. Oh man, uh, oh, can I, did I activate it? Wait a minute, oh no. Can I travel there? Hold on. Oh, I can't travel there, hmm, okay. Let me uh get another sand seal, I guess, because that's just so far. Yeah, let me get a sand seal and I'll be back. All right, we're back. Oh, and now it's cold. Hold on. <laughs> Oops. Uh, yeah. Now it's cold. Darn it. Uh, I have... I have Rito gear, I guess. That'll work? Yeah, there we go. All right. But speaking of this just being a hobby, I will be going back to my job in a couple of months. It's official. I'm on the schedule. Maternity leave is over. It's been a fun ride being home, but must return. Sometimes I think it would be nice for YouTube to just be a full-time job, but I could see how that would like really get to people because you could just get really like in your head about your analytics and stuff. And when you do something for fun and for a hobby and you turn it into a job, then you know, it's not fun anymore. So I definitely appreciate this just being something fun I can do. So I definitely try to approach it from that mind space that I want to do everything I can to keep this fun and enjoyable. Which has to include <laughs> not letting the toxic comments get to me. But there's there's very few. Like 99% of my comments are lovely and helpful. Okay, I have your cocktail. Or no, your cocktail is available at the bar? What was it called? I can't take it anymore. I'm gonna rot here. Actually, go get your fix, ma'am. Huh? <laughs> Did you say best noble pursuit ever? I'm gone. She has suddenly revived. Enjoy your happy hour. All right. The perfect drink complete. All right. I don't know if this is a blessing shrine or regular shrine. We'll see. Usually the blessing shrines involve like a long process to get to it. So I'm hoping it's a blessing shrine. <gasps> I think it is. Yes, please. Yes, Misse Suma's blessing. What does this have for me? This is... Ooh, a diamond. Nice. Okay. All right. I'll take the spirit orb and we will do... That didn't take me too long. We'll do the uh, other shrine here. And just like I keep saying, like the other shrine I feel like was in an area that I explored pretty well. So I'm not sure what I missed. Because I explored that whole back area of the desert pretty well during the episode, the Great Fairy episode. So I'm not sure how I missed it. But we'll head back to it. You know, now that I think about it, there are a ton of Maldugas over there. I probably was trying to dodge something and missed it completely. That's definitely possible. 114 shrines, six left. That is so exciting. I can't wait. All right. Uh, is my sand seal gone? No. No. I wanted to just ride him back over there. Dang it. Yeah, I don't see him. Uh... All right, uh, I'll go rent another one. All right, we back. But yeah, the nice thing about my real job for um, 
new viewers or people who don't know, I work in healthcare. So it's nice to, over here, it's nice to show up for my 12 hour shift. I know I'm making X amount of dollars per hour and I know how much money I'm leaving with at the end of the shift, but I can see how for people who do content creation or YouTube full time, how it could like really mess with your head because you never know what, how much money you're going to make. Like it's impossible to know. Um, oh my God. Yeah, there's a Moldoga here. Am I? Hold on. Uh, I feel like this isn't right. Oh, maybe over here? No, hold on. Yeah, let me... Is it... Did I mark the wrong place? Hmm. Yeah, I think I marked the wrong place. I think it's... It's here. Yeah, I don't know what I... I don't know what I was marking over here. I was gonna say, I definitely was, like, way over here. Like, I, I was on that. That's where I killed a Maldugga. Like, I was over there. <laughs> I was like, I definitely would have known if there was a shrine over there. Unless it was hidden or something, but... Okay, so, yeah, it's this way. So maybe I wasn't over on this part, because I was way kind of in that back area for that great fairy, so... We'll see what's over here. Maybe this was covered by the... No, because the sandstorm is still there sometimes. So I don't know. Um... Ugh, oh, there is a Moldugga. No. Okay, hold on. Let me get up here. I mean, I could just kill it. Oh, there's enemies. Gosh darn it. There's enemies and... Get out of here. Get out of here. That didn't kill them all. Dang it. Can the Moldoga kill these guys for me? That would be great. Am I out of Zurich's protection? Yep. Perfect. Uh, okay. Oh, there's still a guy over there. So what? The shrine's not even over here. It's over... Okay, hold on. Let me get my sand seal back. No! Is that not my sand seal? Dang it! That was just a random one that ran away. Okay, I don't know where mine went then. Where? Over there. Okay. Yeah, I'm still not there. Dang it, I got off my sand seal too soon. That's okay. Okay, there's no Maldugas here. Guess I wasn't over on this part? So I'm out of everything. I'm out of... Dur not everything. I'm out of Dirk's Oh, it's still over there. Oh man, I'm screwed. Okay, when oh god, he can officially Can I I have Revolley's gate, hold on. Let me get let me get over this guy. Let me land on one of these first. Okay. Uh He can't reach me up here, right? Oh my god. So Oh, there's lanterns. Can I just kill him? Hold on. You could just... I mean, that's what I did last time, right? I just, like, bombed the crap out of these guys? They weren't that hard, I remember. Yeah, I don't remember this being that hard. Okay. Uh, what else do I have? Here, I'll take this. Yeah, I'll just knock the crap out of them. Aww. His face. Okay. Oh god. Let me get back up. Oh god. Oh god. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Okay, let me do a bomb again. Throw. Get it. Get it. Get it. No, he didn't get it. I need another one. What is he doing all the way over there, sir? Can you eat my bomb, please? There. No? How does he... How do you get his attention? Hello? It worked earlier. He's just going crazy. Do I just wait for him to... St oh, he needs to go under. I see. Okay. So maybe if I throw it over here? Okay, I feel him. Can you get the bomb? There he goes. Okay. 
Get him. I feel like if I just whack at him a while, this'll... Get him. Maybe I should charge it. Oh, ow. Oh, so close. He just got a little bit left to go. Okay, so now I need to wait for him to stop going crazy. Yeah, I see there's these things I need to light. That's gonna be hard though, because I'm guessing they go out after a certain amount of time. Yeah, it's probably better if I just kill this guy because I can't have something timed while I'm dodging like a huge enemy. And I'm not scared of these guys anymore. I mean, kind of, but after I killed the one in that one episode, uh, I think that was the Thunder Helm episode. So if you haven't seen it, you're new to my channel. Go check it out. Actually, that was a fun episode doing all those side quests. Okay, here you go. No, dang it. Get this. There you go. Eat the bomb, detonate, and this should be the last blow. Boom. There we go. Oh, he made such a sad sound. That's okay. You need to get out of my way. Okay, what gifts does he have for me? Ooh. And in here is... Ooh, a nice bow that I can't fit. Hold on. That, that's a nice one. I'm gonna drop something. Uh, what was it? Uh, it was a royal bow, but a, it had durability. Is that what it was? I think. Yeah, durability. Okay, I'll take that then. Yep. All right. Uh, can't carry any more. So, how do I? Is there a? Well, I guess I can just use a fire arrow, right? I don't care about conserving things anymore. That light it? Okay, it did. Yeah, I'm guessing these all need to be lit quickly. Okay. And then there were four I think I saw. Please, 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 please go, 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 go. And then one over here. Please stay lit, please stay lit. Oh, thank god, okay. Another shrine for me. Yeah, that was definitely... I mean, I guess you could just try to dodge the Maldaga, but definitely I feel like that was easier to just kill it and get it out of the way, in my opinion. Sweet. The Thokeyu Shrine. All right. As I've been saying, I am very lazy, and I hope this is just a blessing shrine so I don't have to solve a bunch of puzzles, but we'll see. So, yeah, this will make 115 shrines. <gasps> is it? Is it a blessing shrine? Yes! Though, okay, you. And it is... A golden bow. Uh, quick shot. No, you know what? I'm just gonna leave it. I don't care. I have a ton- I, I, I have good bows. Quick shot, though. That's pretty cool, though. I don't think I've gotten a bow that was a quick shot. Maybe if I was, a. Uh, if I hadn't beaten the game and had a bunch of combat left to do, I would do it. I would grab it, but... Since the game has been beaten, that is not a priority. I am just finishing these shrines for funsies. And... Five more to go. Alright, uh... This has been a short episode, actually. Um... Let me, let me mark some more shrines here. Just a sec. All right, I am back in kind of this area of the map. There's two shrines over here that I missed uh, in this area. So I'll head to this one first since it looks like I can just kind of launch myself over there. Oh, a silent princess. I will take that. All right. And uh, I guess I'll just Revali Gale. Yep. Head over there. Oh, it's cold? Uh, How long is it going to be cold for? I don't remember this being a cold area. Okay, yeah, it's hurting me. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay. Uh, do, do, do. I have Rito stuff. Where's my Rito stuff? Let me put on... Let me put 
this on. There we go. That's good enough. Again, I feel like I was over here. <laughs> I know I keep saying that. And you guys are probably like, uh, no, you weren't. Uh, this way. Because, yeah, I kind of I came kind of came through here to get to read a village. All right. Well, there must have been some tiny corner. What is that? Some tiny corner I didn't explore. Cass! Hold on. Is it? So this must be a shrine. What is this? Is there another shrine over here? Hi, Cass. <laughs> what? Wait, but it's not over here, though. Is there a shrine over here I already did that he's going to sing about? I am so confused. Oh, no. Do I have stamina stuff? Uh, food. Stamina, please. Stamina. Here we go. Cass? Oh god, it's raining! <laughs> oh, my dog. She's banging on the door. When the moon bleeds. Oh, excuse me. Was that a bit rough on the ears? I mean, I could hear you from pretty far away. Ah, you've done well climbing all the way up here. I know a song about this place. Would you like to hear the ancient verse passed down in this region? Let's hear it. Excellent. Without further ado. When the moon bleeds and the fiends are reborn. Oh, blood moon. The monks will invite you. Oh, it's here. Okay. The monks will invite you as they have sworn. But first you must stand on the pedestal bare. With nothing between you. I have to be naked again? I mean, I was already naked on eventide. Okay. Wait, what? When the moon bleeds. So it's a blood moon. May the light illuminate your path. So when there's a blood moon, I have to be naked on the pedestal? Okay, well, let me um, reset my marker for here because I was off, obviously. Oh, actually, I wasn't that off. Let me uh, let me make it like more current location. I'll put a red one. Huh, red for red. So I have to wait for... I just had a blood moon not that long ago. Okay. Uh, well, I guess I'll uh, have to come back to that. There was another shrine over here. Is there any- is there a fast way here? I guess I can go back to Satori Mountain and glide over there, maybe? Yeah. Let me, uh, let me do that. Alright, we're back. And this is really not a good time for it to be raining, since I'm having to climb through this rocky area to get to this shrine. Uh, what are the trees and stuff? <gasps> oh! A Korok! A Korok! A Korok! Hold on, not that it matters. Oh god. Okay, hold on. <laughs> but I feel like since I saw it- Oh my gosh, are you kidding me with this rain? It's, uh, you know what? No, I'm sorry. The Korok's just gonna have to stay- Oh my god, there's so many apples over here. Whoa. It's like an orchard. Wow. Alright. You can chop down all the trees. Like Johnny Appleseed. Okay, where, where am I heading? Okay, so it was just past this bridge. Okay, there's something there. It's like rock formations and stuff. Maybe something amongst here. Maybe another puzzle? Hmm. What's that? Oh, it's just bushes and stuff. Okay. Yeah, there's definitely something here. There's all these, uh... It's, it's definitely a puzzle. There, but are you kidding me? Is that Cass again? Dude, you get around- well, I guess he's a bird. You know, I'm starting to think Cass, like, isn't the brightest bird in the flock. Because I feel like some of these puzzles aren't that hard. Like, the Blood Moon? I feel like that was a pretty obvious one. And and the NPCs know about Blood Moons, I think. I think they've talked- I've talked to NPCs about Blood Moons before. You made it over here, bro. Aww. Oh. I did not hear your approach. I was lost in this song written by my late teacher. He passed away several years ago, you see, and this is the last song he taught me. Excuse me, I may have- I fear I may have gotten carried away. Nostalgia will do that to a person. I know a song about this place. Would you like to hear the ancient verse passed down in this region? Let's hear it. Excellent. Did I just miss a bunch of cast shrines? When a single arrow threads two rings. Two rings? Okay. Uh. The shrine will rise like birds on wings. Okay. So I have to get it through two of these at the same time? Do you think the rings in the song refer to these oddly shaped rocks? And what of the shrine? 
Do, of course they refer to these. There's a mystery to be uncovered here, that's for sure. And I get the feeling the truth is beyond my wildest imagination. May the light illuminate your path. That's what I was just saying. I feel like uh, he's not the brightest bird in the flock. Like, I feel like it's obviously has to do with these formations. So I just have to find two that line up and shoot an arrow through it, is what it sounds like. Or, oh god, are there multiple that you can like, like there's multiple you can do it. C come on, man. Get out of my way here. Like, right here looks good. Like, I feel like I can line these two up pretty good. Maybe if I go at it from the top. Maybe this way. Oh, maybe, no, because these aren't facing each other. Right, let me go over uh, this way, maybe. Like, if, can I shoot it? Hmm. I don't know if that lines up. Looks like it does. I don't know. I'm curious if there's only one solution to this or if there's multiple ways. Like, maybe this high up one? I could get a good angle. Let me see. No, not that way. Maybe... No, nothing over there. Okay. So I think I'm just gonna have to go to these one by one and see where it lines up. Uh, no. This one? Over here? No. Maybe from the back way? Uh, oh god. And then it's raining so I can't even freaking climb up these stupid things. Uh, I feel like that one doesn't work either. Let me check. Was there one over here? No. Oh wait. Uh, did I? Really, I think I already checked that one. Let's check this one. Anything through here? No. This way, maybe. Uh, you know, I I feel like no. I don't think that would work. Check this one. This way, no. This way, no. Okay, well at least it's not raining anymore. That will significantly help this process. Thank you. Uh, are there more? Well, there's one by Cass. I didn't even check that one. But I feel like that one's so far. Oh, and there's some behind him too. But I feel like... Surely it has to be one of these over here. Maybe. Actually, I feel like this one... Did I already... I feel like this one's gonna be good. How do I change um, arrows? Oh my gosh. Let me... Oh my god. Just just go to the inventory, please. Uh, regular arrows. I feel like... Okay, here, yeah. Oh, okay. Did that work? Oh my gosh, okay. A little lower. A little lower. Yes, okay. I looked around for a while. I feel like that was the only one I could find that looked okay. So... I don't know if there's multiple ways to solve that or if that's the only one that works. Cool. Hopefully since this is a shrine quest, this will just be another blessing shrine. Shim Dagoze. Dagoze? Dagoze. Well, that was a cool one too. Yeah, I, I feel like I've missed a lot of puzzle shrine quests. Quests. I can't talk today. Sorry, I was distracted because I could hear my daughter crying in the background. But like I said, she's with grandma. She's fine. Grandma needs to learn to soothe her. I can't be the only one that can do it, especially now that I'm going back to work, like I said earlier, moving in parallel. Uh, okay, so what do these buttons do? Okay. Aha, I see. Okay, so what does this do? Can't see. Oh. D did I just completely do this on accident? Oh no, there's another one over there. Well, yeah, I kind of did actually. So where's this? I need another ball. <laughs> okay, I had no idea what I was doing and I got one of them. Where's... Oh, there's the ball. Okay. So I need it to go... Hold on. I need it to go... This way. Is that it? Okay, cool. Well, there's... Pro I'm sure there's a chest somewhere. Where's... 
Or is there a chest? I literally don't even know how you would get to a chest. Now I'm just curious. I, don't, I mean, I'm not going to bother with it, but I literally don't know where there could even possibly be a chest. Yeah, I don't... I don't even see anything. It's probably super obvious. I'll probably see it in editing and be like, oh, there it is. I've said this before, but there's so many times where like I miss something and I see it in editing and I'm like, ah, <laughs> and not that I'm trying to get all chests, so it's not a big deal. Well, that was cool. I completely on accident got the first part of the puzzle. All right. Well, how many, uh, how many shrines am I at now? I might be able to finish this in the next episode. I'll have to come back to that blood moon one. Uh, cause I'm not, I'm not sure on that one. Okay. So for the blood moon one, I kind of cheated. I, I looked it up. Like I, I know, I understand the puzzle, but I was like, I just don't have time to sit around and wait for a blood moon. Like I'm trying to get these, like I have a child now. I don't have time to be sitting around. Cause I think it's every like two hours, two and a half hours of game time that the, uh, oh, the guy at the stable said we could take those apples if we want them. Okay. Um, it's like every two and a half hours a gameplay or something that a blood moon resets everything and I was like I don't I had one not too long ago but I, I just was like I don't know how you're supposed to time that so there's a guy here at dueling peaks and I actually think I was talking about him earlier there's a guy here at dueling peaks I thought was it here did I read something wrong that you can talk to and he'll tell you when there's a blood moon hey. oh is it I can give you direct no I no thanks is it this guy tonight Oh, you again. Are you interested in my research? Uh, Blood Moon? Whenever the clock strikes midnight on unlucky nights, that's the sky turns blood red. That's the Blood Moon. When that happens, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, is it tonight? Well, ask me anything. Is it tonight? Tonight is a full moon. Looks like it could come falling down any minute. I can't take my eyes off of it. Well, ask, okay, so it's not tonight. So basically, there's this guy that you can come talk to and he'll tell you if there's going to be a Blood Moon that night. And then even though the Blood Moon comes up like, you know, right at a certain time you have like a few hours before i think before and after to get to the plate so um i'll have to just come check with this guy so i'll do that in the next episode thank you guys so much for joining me today and if you enjoyed your time leave a like and say hi down in the comments below and consider subscribing if you want to catch more of this series and i'll see you guys in the next episode of breath of the wild